Well, after months of investigative work by Eyewitness News, tonight the mayor's office is admitting Mayor Latoya Cantrell has been staying at a city-owned apartment rent-free in the French Quarter. This comes after the Metropolitan Crime Commission called for the city council to investigate. The mayor's communications director says Cantrell is allowed to stay at the apartment under the city's agreement with the French Market Corporation. As, as Eleanor Tabone reports, the mayor is getting a near $3,000 a month apartment. The mayor's office now admits Latoya Cantrell has been living in a city-owned apartment rent-free. She really has not done her job. The Upper Pontable, managed by the French Market Corp, has been her home for months. According to a detailed report from MCC to New Orleans City Council, it included pictures and allegations from neighbours. The market rate to rent there is $2,991 a month. But Mayor Cantrell has apparently not paid any rent this year. A Jackson Square employee told me she has seen the mayor walking in this direction towards apartment 530B. Records obtained by WWL-TV through a public records request found emails from the mayor asking a city staffer to get things fixed in the apartment. Complaining the shower wasn't hot in January. Asking to fix a toilet seat back in February and their Wi-Fi wouldn't work in March. MCC President Rafael Goinechi is questioning whether living rent-free in a city property is allowed. That is a hospitality suite. It's not meant to be the living quarters of the mayor of the city of New Orleans. That's an additional benefit, tax-free, that she's been receiving. A little ironic that this would be a, a perfect spot. Across the way from the alleged apartment, the Cantrell recall booth. Taking advantage of amenities that, you know, that may or may not be hers to begin with. And harsh criticism of the mayor. It's ridiculous that we have a city that is so fantastic as New Orleans and is so poorly run. But there's support for the mayor on Twitter. One user called out the MCC saying during a wave of violent crime against the citizens of New Orleans who authorised the MCC expenditure of hundreds of manpower hours in surveillance on a mayor changing her clothes in an apartment owned by the city. Others weighed in calling the investigation sexist and saying past mayors use the apartment. Councilman Eugene Green said in part that he's not aware of any regulations or procedures that may have been violated. Eleanor Tabone, Eyewitness News. Cantrell Communication Director Gregory Joseph said in a statement this evening, quote, the mayor's usage of the city-owned apartment at the Pontabla is consistent with the usage of previous mayors. In the 2013 franchise agreement, there are no rules governing how that unit should be used, and the FMC believes the mayor has no obligation to pay rent on that apartment because she's using it in the same manner that previous mayors have enjoyed.